Welcome back to the five. We're hey. right where we left off playing the Yow. And we're still wearing the same outfits. Yeah, because it's still the same day for us. Oh, man. Yeah. Oh. Woo! Let's <laughs> play. That's what we're telling you. Mm. So, Wait, start, start, start. Earth. Oh, okay, so the world's ending. Where, where do I go? The world is ending at week six. Six? So that was ten. We're halfway there. <clears throat> oh. So um, where do you want to go, Kevin? You know, I have been kidnapped by orcs, lost the game of darts. And, and you also saw Demi Baby. Oh, I didn't see it. No, that was me. That was me. Oh, yeah, I kind of yeah. want to go to the... Um, you know, I, I kind of want to go back to the tavern. I mean, I want to redeem myself. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do some more bartending, you know, get back to my day job. <clears throat> she looks so happy. You spend the week serving drinks at the tavern. You earn one wealth and tips and gain two charm. Dang it, they're Ooh. still so cheap. <laughs> one day a bard pulls out his loot in the bar and starts playing a tune. Unfortunately, his singing is horrible and is ruining the tavern's atmosphere. He decided to do something about it. Oh, come on, dude. Oh, it is so on. It <laughs> yes. is on. Loot to loot to. Loot hero. <laughs> Musical duel. Oh, sorry. You borrow the bar's owner's <laughs> flute loot and then challenge loot. the bar to a musical flute. duel. Loot. You play out a beautifully complex combination of arpeggios. I hope I'm not singing. The tavern roars with applause. Tries his best to replicate your piece, but ends up dropping the his loot, snapping it in half. Take that noob! Jerk. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a terrible person. He bows his head shamefully in defeat and walks out of the tavern. Woo! <laughs> you gain one finesse, one charm, and gain five, and I'm a terrible person. <laughs> Let's go to the arena. I must strengthen up. Compete in the fight. Yeah! You spend the week fighting brutes in the arena. You gain two physique and one finesse. Finesse. Yes. One day in the middle of a match, a small baby with jet black. No! Not the demon and baby! glowing eyes flies into the center of the arena. Not the demon baby. Fire erupts from his eyes, melting the flesh off of the one of the fighters. Uh, oh uh, no! Uh, the baby then shapes just slowly into a gargantuan horned demon. What it's is my it? time to shine. Before I go on a murderous rampage, will anybody challenge me to a duel? Ask the demon. You know, man. do it. I'll do it. I challenge him. Well, looks like we have here the demon says responding. Oh, well, look what we have here. The demon says responding into a stepping forward. You pull out your weapon, ready for combat. The demon tilts his head forward and charges. Lost dash ability activate. You run full speed at charging demon with your wind raised above your head. The demon ducks under your weapon and hits you with the force so hard you black out. Dang it! <laughs> The, your dream of the world crumbling at the feet around you? No! When you come to, you wake in your home and a message carved onto your chest. Oh! You've got gut challenge. I respect that. It reads. <laughs> I can your small blessing set. You remember the <laughs> challenge a demon in the future. You feel wiser. Cool! Yes! Totally worth it. Huh? <laughs> well, I believe that I'm I going... I think I take a demon. I'm going... Oh, the place is burnt down. <laughs> oh, you destroyed the... You destroyed the arena! It was the demon! I'm going to go to the palace. And I'm going to attend the ball again. I spend the week attending fancy gatherings. I gain two charm and one finesse. Boom! I'm so charming. One the day you accidentally bump into a duke. The duke? Watch where you're going, filthy peasant. He shoves you out of the way with his hand and continues walking. <laughs> you know what to do. Passive aggressive. That outfit looks really comfortable. Burn! <laughs> he looks mildly insulted. <laughs> Sick burn! Man. Bo! That's how you do it. You gain one child. Alright. Let's see. Um. So smart. Let's head to the forest. No, oh no. Makes sense. <laughs> I'm going to chop wood. Woo! You spend the week at 
cutting down trees for the village. You gain two physique and earn yourself one wealth. Woo! One day you come across a group of people. From the expressions on their faces, they appear to be lost. <laughs> Rob them! Help them. Oh, no fun. You confront the group and try to help them find their way back to town. With ease, you lead everyone back to town. Yay! Extremely grateful. The group gives you a small token of their appreciation. They kill you. Oh. You gain two <laughs> wealth. Well, somebody's rich money bags. They have six wealth. When, when it arrives this time, time, how will we fare? Fair. Will we <laughs> once more rebuild? Move on, be strong. Strong? Or have, or have we, we forgotten? Forgotten, forgotten yeah, what? Forgot the last time. Oh, too late. We already forgot. Did we read something? Just not. Thank you. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, uh, I really want to go back to the tavern, but. <laughs> you know, they love me at the tavern. Oh, I want to go there again. You know, I'm going to I'm gonna drink this time. I got to celebrate. Woo! Oh, yeah. We get wasted. Oh, yeah. Oh, sorry. You spend the entire week getting wasted. You gain two charm and one physique because beer's healthy. <laughs> one day, a fortune teller sets up at one of the tavern's tables. Wow. She offers to read anybody's fortune for a small sum. Do it. Um, you can afford it. Yeah, but Do it, do it, do it. Whatever, yeah, sure. Whatever. You spit my mouth! Woo! A fortune teller takes your hand and begins showering you with promises of love and wealth. I feel uncomfortable. <laughs> she doesn't really go into any detail, and the whole time you can't help but feel this is all an act. Oh, boo. Oh, money back. Oh, God. Well, you're wrong, <laughs> it's slightly poorer. You can't help but feel like you've wasted your money. You should have done it. That night while walking home, whoa, the fortune teller runs up to you and gives you a kiss on the cheek. There's a love part, she says with a toothless uh, smile. Aww. And then she has you again, she's like gold! <laughs> oh! There's the wealth, she says. Aww. She was a nice lady. So she gave one. She oh. was she was a nice lady. I aww. I actually still think I'm a hack. <laughs> um ellipses. Oh, okay, I guess I don't answer. Let's go to back to the salons. I must attend my piece. That. Let's fight crime! You spend the week outsmarting beating up criminals. <laughs> I can't get over this image. <laughs> one mind and one physique and one finesse. Like, what is he looking at? One night, a man walks up to you. What is he doing right now? <laughs> Excuse me, sir. Feeling a little lonely tonight, yes? Oh. <laughs> uh, I'm not sure what's going to happen here. For a small amount of coin, I can make your night... <laughs> a good old night. <laughs> sure! <laughs> oh. He's gonna kill you. I'm curious as to what's gonna happen, guys. It's not weird. You hand them over. A, you hand them over a small bat sack of coins. All of your money. Oh dang it! You lose two wealth. On your way to your house, you start about talking about philosophy, story, magic, everything. Really? Okay. This is great. You two have an amazing conversation that goes well more. It goes well into the morning. See, I told you. Aww. Two mind and two charm. The man apologizes for the lack of what sex, but thank you for the chat. He refunds you back half of what you spent. Woo! You gain one love. You guys thought it was How a does bad that idea. escalate? From We're just talking. Fighting crime. We're just spending the I night. <laughs> just like I'm taking down pickpocketers. Oh, I'm just gonna like talk with this guy for a while. My city doesn't need me anymore. I'm going to the gardens. It wasn't bad. I'm going to meditate. Spin the week in deep meditation. Mm. I gain one magic and two mind. One day you come across an elderly man snoozing on the grass. You there, young person. He waves you over. I'm having an awful time trying to nap in the Stop bright sun. sounding like a demon child. <laughs> maybe, maybe it is the demon child. He's grown up. He's grown up. Oh, yeah. Do you mind giving me some shade? No. Will black the sun for the old man. Ages seem to pass as you stand in the hot sun, the wizened old man sleeping peacefully in your shadow. And then he kills you. The sun is sweltering, and after some hours, you begin to feel the hours. And then he kills you. Gradually, everything grows. <laughs> oh, crap. 
when you awaken, it is evening in the garden, and an ancient gnarled tree stands where the old man was sleeping. For witnessing this miraculous event, I gain one magic. Woo! Huh? Your turn, Lance. Lance. Hmm. Hospital. Clean up. You spend the week stealing your mind against the horrors of the hospital, making sure it is as clean as it can be. You gain one mind. One physique and earn one wealth. Like no money. <coughs> one day, a patient comes into the hospital with sores that nobody's seen, oh, ever no. seen before. While walking by his bedside, he looks to you and rudely asks <clears throat> for a glass of water. Rudely. Get him water. But he said rudely. You bring him a small glass to quench his thirst. He takes a large sip, swigs it around, <laughs> and then. Proceeds to spit it at you. Germination. Uh, you did. The water hits you right in the face. You're dead. Yeah, you're so dead. After cleaning up, you scold the obviously insane man for spitting at you. That night, when you get oh, home, oh crap. you feel dizzy and start having vivid hallucinations about ancient shit. Shut up. What? <laughs> <magic. laughs> Alright. <laughs> this game. This is. Lose three mind. Ooh. That was your best. <gasps> Not anymore. But he's I still like it. better in everything than any of us. Uh, so so maybe it was worth. worth. The yog, it's, it's almost, almost here. here. But not today, so we're good. Almost. The final Guys, week. It's getting pretty good. Oh man, it's outside. getting kind of oh, okay. Jim. Um, you know, <sighs> kind of want to go back to the forest, you know. Back where oh, I, I destroyed the arena. Back where really I right. started. <laughs> kind of want to hunt again, you know. Kind of ferrets. <laughs> you spend the week hunting defenseless critters to feel my wrath. You gain two finesse and Zelda belts for one well. <laughs> one day you stumble upon a gigantic moss-covered stone. It pulses with a magical energy. No. What do you do? Touch it. Touch it! <laughs> you lay your hand under the enormous object. I've just said you explode. The stone's magical <laughs> <Don't you> energy <laughs> shoots into your body! Hey, I gained a magic. Oh, Woo! Oh, really? Oh, let's no. spend the last day inside the palace. That was it? Oh. Last week, I guess you could say. Let's attend the ball. Oh, look how fancy Oh, you look so classy. We spent the week attending... Fancy gatherings. Oh, 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 oh. Such a small wine glass. You gain two charm, one finesse. That's okay. <laughs> one day the king approaches you. <gasps> the king! Excuse me, but you look like someone who I can confide in, he says. My boy. I <laughs> want a prince to take over the throne, but the queen and I. <gasps> aren't you exactly active in the bathroom? Bedroom? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> oh, wait. What's with this... you, MB? <laughs> Sorry. He blushes a little. Hmm. Well, it looks like you're blushing pretty much too. So. I am. Do you have any? Oh, do you have any advice on how I would romance the queen, so to speak? <laughs> Teach the king my ways. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> you spend hours drawing a bunch of diagrams and going through scenarios with the king. <laughs> By the end of it, he's just as charming as you are. <laughs> I left. He thanks you and hands you a large sack of coins as a reward. Boo! You gain three wealth. <clears throat> Dude, I'm I gonna, wonder what's for dinner. I'm gonna head to the. Uh, you're gonna go to the hospital. And I'm gonna. Dinner the baby. Baby child. You spend the week oh, no. diagnosing and tending to the sick. Oh, no, they're terrible I gain two mind and earn this. one wealth. Oh no. One day you oh, hear great. spooky sounds echoing through the hospital. Oh crap. Soon afterwards, oh, a glowing blue ghost floats down Perfect. from the ceiling. She seems to be wandering the halls aimlessly, howling out horrible noises. She doesn't appear to realize that she is freaking everyone out. You decide to do something about it. I'm going Faith to- Faith to go some magic! No, but I, I'm better- Sorry. I'm better with charm. I'm going to talk calmly to the ghost. I approach the spirit and try to explain to her the effect 
effects she is having on the sick. This is weird. She seems to understand what you're telling her and apologizes for bothering everybody. She walks through a wall and is never seen again. Yay! A doctor tosses you a sack of coins. It's a way of saying thanks. He's <laughs> tossing it like here. I get too well. <laughs> Ow. Yeah. Hit here. In the face. All right. Tavern. I don't think I've ever been to the alchemy. Bartending. Drink on your yeah, last night. I have a big deal over there. <laughs> you spend just, the week serving deal. drinks at the tavern. <laughs> Jerk. <laughs> Learn one wealth and dips and gain two charms. Two charms are those. Over the course of the week, you notice yourself growing more and more spiral shaped sores all over your body. He was super easy. One day, sores began glowing a vibrant blue. You feel your magical power grow even way. stronger while your mind slips. There goes your, your mind. You gain three Again! <laughs> Again? In no time, the sores are glowing so bright that they hurt to look at. <laughs> Someone rushes up to you asking if you're alright. You <laughs> set him aflame. Uh, and you let out a scream that shakes the earth and shatters. Uh, you're the bad guy! Uh, a river of blood uh, <laughs> Rebelling in your destruction. You black out. Jerk. Oh. This always happens. You're at home in your bed. Your sores have faded, and you feel it. You destroyed the tavern, didn't you? Yay, I'm better. Oh, the storm, the storm arrives in the night. night. This is really By the By morning, the morning it still it's still rages. rages. For three full days, the tempest puts us up. through a, a grinder, grinder. drowns what? us, crushes us, ruins us. But, but then, then it ends. Oh. We see the graveyard of our home become our home. Does anything yet live? Is it? Are we past saving? Oh, it was pretty, pretty bad shape Let's to begin with. I mean, out. no entertainment, no tavern. Oh! Alright! Oh, wait. Kevin, choose your role. Oh! You know. You know, I. You saw how good I was at like hunting, right? Town drunk. <laughs> <laughs> Way to be a productive part of the rebuilding effort. I'm awesome. <laughs> <laughs> you s <laughs> you scavenge together as much alcohol as you can <laughs> and drink excessively. You gain two physique and one shot. Why is alcohol like P90X here? <laughs> Huh. Pretty strong. Pretty I'd mindful. Say, I'd say I could be a good leader. You could be a builder or a leader. I've been. I want to become leader. Okay. Is that alright? Yeah. yeah. <clears throat> you take it upon yourself to be the leader of the survivors. Overachiever. Alright. You effectively delegate and prioritize tasks. And by night you fight crime. <laughs> You give a lot of pats on the back, rewarding everyone's hard work. Except for me. Kevin. Yeah. yeah. Kevin. I think good stuff. This helps revealing effort a lot. I bring Yay. the party. I bring the party. Oh boy. Let's see. Good in mind, charm, decent in finesse. Hmm. Um, Work lot in the hospital. Um. Oh. Yeah, we'll go with the doctor. This is smart. You take it upon yourself to help the sick and injured from the yaw. You are able to keep most patients in stable condition. Some are even able, even able to get up and back to work in no time. Woo! This helps the survival effort quite a you bit. You do nothing for the survival effort. Screw <laughs> me. Um, I think your magic, so you the can be the con conjurer. Yeah, mm -hmm. unless if you want to do something else. I mean, yeah. that's just... Or you could just be the looter and just with money, completely Jake. ruin our efforts like Kevin. Uh, <laughs> do it, do it, do it. Come on, come on, come on. We do this to get. We're in this together. We can like form a coalition. Conjure. You take it upon yourself to help conjure up supplies for the town. Uh, Am I wait. the only one that thought conjure was like summoning spirits? You magic. If you summon supplies of the highest caliber. Eh. Come on, sure. 
little effort, you're summoning high quality lumber and food from out of nowhere. Woo! Oh, 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 this helps the rebuilding okay. effort significantly. Do we win? And so we set about our tasks. One more living, oh, once more living our lives. This time, in a way we might never have expected, expected. or even wanted. I kind of expected it. But in the end, I, kind of I live. Right. It was a struggle, but a struggle we never abandoned. Through our home, thou, the, I ruined it. That Though our home had been stripped apart, we did not let it languish. And whether we succeed or fail, we did our best. Yeah. Who knows if the Yog will visit us again? Who knows if we will ever be, can ever be, ready for it? Mm -hmm. Did we win? Woo! It looks, looks happy enough. With the old tavern owner dying in the yow, you decide to take on the task. I don't look too good. Before long, the tavern's busier than ever because of my awesome loot skills. Filled with good music from me. Games and friends, just not darts. I banned that game. <laughs> Your tavern's doing so great that every other tavern in the area has closed down. Monopoly! <laughs> Woo! You start a chain of taverns throughout the city to no, fill the demand. Jerk. I call it ye old McDonald's. <laughs> Each new tavern you open makes it more difficult to manage all of them. Oh. You begin enacting policies that make it easier for you to keep track of how the taverns are being run. Taverns all start to become bland and interesting places to be. But since you have a monopoly, you're still yeah. making ridiculous amounts of money. Man, am I awesome. <laughs> so, you win? With the town being rebuilt, you don your costume once more, eager to fit cry, fight crime. In an odd twist of events, the Yog appears to have brought everyone closer together. You can't seem to find even the trace of criminal activity in town. Boo! You travel to new lands in search of crime that must be punished. Sounds legit. Mm. Good guy. Good for you, man. The Yog changed you, probably for the better. With the town being rebuilt, you eventually decide to retake your role as a doctor in the hospital. Ooh. There you make friends with another doctor. The two of you do everything together, and you're inseparable. Eventually, you even decide to get an apartment and live with each other. Aww. Then your friend gets married. <laughs> Everything Aww. changes. Was she being friend zoned? Oh, man! Aww. Your spouse has to move away. Oh. You're trying to keep in touch with the mail, but the letters start to come less and less frequently. Sad. I try to fraternize with the other doctors. While they're all nice people, nothing can compare. <laughs> Cecilia! That's what well, I need. What? I thought I was Shakisha. No, that's that... the name of the other doctor. Or oh, you okay. You can come to any of my old McDonald's and get a free drink. And you can help me. I hate you. you. <laughs> yeah, you bum. Get out, get out of this town. I'm not a bum. I own a monopoly. <laughs> With the town being rebuilt, you spend nearly all of your time in the alchemy tower. You try desperately to research a cure that, for that mysterious spiral sore disease that caused you to hurt all those people. Wait, so like, I'm just going to totally forget about that. Like, all the time in the lab, you're just taking a toll on your body. I'm okay. Spiral sores like you can pass your son to your skin. Oh, Drunk. boy. Uh -oh. That's not good. Oh, crap. Not wanting to repeat the best. You walk out oh, no! Oh. To the water. Oh! You swim out as far as possible. Oh, crap. A faint explosion was spotted on the lake that night. Some say it was the birth of a new star. Um, oh, wait. Wait, so Edward survived? Died. <laughs> he died. <laughs> Dude, I think mine was like the only happy ending. Hey, I was pretty happy. Well, fine, I had I, an empty life. I got myself away from everyone. <laughs> He's drinking in sorrows. Alright, so that was the I yard. I survived and lived happily. I'm so lonely. <laughs> the yard. At least you survived. Yeah, but that you'll see you like next star. time, YouTube. Like awesome. Leave a comment and a like below and subscribe if you like what we're doing here yeah yeah and don't like if you want to see if you want to see more of this tell us tell us please Woo! all right yeah that's it all right deuces yes. bye wait 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 wait
Wait. Yeah. 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 <clears throat> I survived.